Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Um, I want to do a collection update video of some things that I literally just picked up today from a somewhat local toy shop uh, that I just discovered. Um, there was <clears throat> a toy store called uh, Closeted Toys or Toys in the Closet or something like that uh, in a town about 40 minutes from me. So I just took a drive and really wasn't sure what I was going to get. And I ended up getting quite a few things. And uh, they're all Power Ranger related this time. Um, I've had quite a few Godzilla videos lately. So this one's going to veer back into Power Rangers. And really excited for what I got. There's one thing in particular that I got there I picked up today. Uh, it was a grail of mine as far as Power Rangers. So I'm beyond excited to show it off. And for the price I got, I am so stoked, so excited. So without further ado, let's get into it. So this, turn the, whoops, sorry guys. This is the Power Rangers Ninja Steel uh, Lion Fire Fortress Zord. It has three different modes, as you guys can see here. It has the Megazord mode, the Ultra Megazord mode, or the Fortress mode. So the box is pretty beat up, which is okay. Um, and mostly got it just for the Zord itself. So here's the Megazord mode, when it's like that. And here's the Ultra Megazord mode, which it kind of opens and... Uh, the ranger sits in there and it has cannons and then the very bottom here i don't know if you can see it is the <clears throat> uh the fortress mode um and oh i'm sorry i think i called this the fortress mode this is the ultra megazord mode and down here is the fortress mode so this guy's pretty damn big uh, as you can see on the box right up here it says it's over 20 inches tall and it's from ninja steel um i know it's not a very popular series in power rangers uh, it was okay to me, um, and the best thing to me was the, was it Dimensions in Danger or whatever with the anniversary episode, that was the best, um, but the Zords are pretty cool, so yeah, I wanted to get that. And, oh, um, uh, I keep, I've been forgetting to do that, so I just, I picked this up for 75 bucks. Uh, I've been meaning to do the price of what I was able to get things for. I know I said I was going to start doing that, and I keep forgetting, and I apologize. Um, keeping with Ninja Steel, I got the um, Megazord and Cannon set. So this kind of looks just like... Now, I've never really seen all of uh, Ninja Steel, so I can't really make too much of a comment on it. Um, when it comes to the later seasons, I'm kind of a Megazord only type of person. Um, and I don't collect everything Power Rangers as it is. I'm mostly a Megazord person, um, with the exception of the first few seasons. Um, I will try and collect what I can. But, um, so anyways, yeah, this is the Megazord and the Canon. Uh... Looks pretty cool. Uh, I was able to get this for 40 bucks. It's still sealed and new, which is neat. Uh, it has the transformation of the Ninja Star uh, and how it morphs into the cannon and it launches a missile, which is cool. And it also comes, like I said, with the Megazord. It has the, I don't even know what the names of the Zords are. How bad is that? But uh, yeah, I don't know, pretty cool for 40 bucks. Couldn't really pass it up. All right. Next is we're going to transition into the 2017 Power Rangers film. This is the Megazord. And it comes with the five Rangers. So this is the one where the, the, the Zords don't disconnect. It is just the figure of the Megazord. And uh, it lights up and uh, has sound and all that fun stuff. Uh, it still has the pull tab. It's still sealed, brand new. Uh, I was real excited to see that. Um, it's it, it's fine for a Megazord, I suppose. I don't like it as a version of uh, the Mighty Morphin. 
you know, Mega Zord, uh, I think it leaves a lot to be desired. But just as a normal Zord, I think it's fine. Uh, it's not going to win any awards, in my opinion, but it is what it is. It, it looks honestly more like a Jaeger from Pacific Rim, in my opinion. But, uh, and I am a completionist, so with that being said, I had to get all the Megazords. And when I saw that, I thought it was kind of cool. And uh, I got this for $40 as well, so... Next is the 2017 Goldar. Uh, by far the least favorite part of that film to me was the design of Goldar. Or as the Power Trip podcast calls them, not Goldar, which I believe is true. This comes with Rita Repulsa, which is cool. Um, yeah, it just leaves a lot to be desired. It's just your general sludge monster i guess um but uh it was 10 bucks so i got it all right continuing the thread of the 2017 movie i got the pterodactyl zord the triceratops the Mastodon, and the Sabertooth Tiger, which, again, my I, I'm not a huge fan of the redesigns of these things. Um, the Pterodactyl is fine, I suppose. Uh, the rest of them, honestly, like, I don't, I don't understand the eight-legged tarantula Mastodon thing. Um, a lot of that, I, I think, was a very big disappointment for many fans, my, you know, myself included. Um, and of course, last but not least, is the T-Rex Zord, again from the 2017 movie. Um, out of all of them, <clears throat> I'm going to move this just a smidge. Um, out of all of them of the 2017 movie, I think the T-Rex is my favorite, uh, just as like in the original, the T-Rex was my favorite Zord. Um, and this one does look the best, in my opinion. So I was able to get the complete set, which was very, very cool. And, oh, I almost forgot about this guy. Uh, so they also have this. Uh, it is from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, still sealed. A little bit of wear on, uh, on, the, on the card. But it is the Evil Minotaur from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Uh, they had this for uh, 20 bucks, So I picked them up. Um, each one of the 2017 Zords were $20 a piece, except for the Rex, which was $50. Um, I ended up getting everything that I'm, that I'm showing you guys today for a total of $400. So I was able to bargain with them once the once i picked everything out and while you're kind of maybe thinking to yourself 400 for what you just showed joe that seems like a lot and you would be correct if i didn't also get this thing which was my grail as far as what i didn't have in in collecting power rangers and megazords and whatnot I had been searching for this for years. Many of them popped up on eBay and whatnot for three, four, five hundred dollars, maybe even more. I was able to get the cute the Power Rangers Time Force Quantasaurus Rex Megazord. This is the deluxe. Um, it comes with the controller bracelet, and I opened it up and uh, uh, checked through it. It has all the pieces it looks good um the box is a little damaged here in the back but other than that relatively minor shelf wear the figure itself looks pretty good um very lightly some light wear obviously for a figure that's you know what 25 years old or something like that uh 20 something years old um 
really good condition the box is in really good condition and like i said this was my grail and i was so 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 excited uh to see this and then when they told me what the price was i couldn't believe it and i absolutely knew if i was only walking away with one thing today that this was going to be it i was able to score this for 150 dollars and i was so excited for that because like I said earlier, so many of them are going for three, four, five hundred dollars or more on eBay and in private sellers and things like that. And uh, yeah, I was I was stoked. Comes with all the missiles, all the attachments. Like I said, the remote control, all of it, uh, or the quantum morpher. So this I'm so excited for. I can't wait to open it up again and put it together and display it um yeah so all right guys that's gonna do it for today like i said i was able to pick these up at a local toy store near me i really hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys do uh give me a like give me a subscribe please subscribe i really appreciate all the new subscribers that's been really great um comment on the videos tell me what you'd like to see more of tell me if you'd like to see something reviewed uh, individually instead of just like a, a video of many things maybe you want to see a video of just one thing and as always, guys, take care, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.